You are now entering Crazy Joe's Galaxy. Enjoy the wild ride. You are now entering through the galaxy. It is time for the heavyweight championship of the world in glory kickboxing at Glory 20 in Paris. We get an awesome fight as Rico Van Hooven is going against um, Meldon. I'm not sure how you say his name. It's very, <clears throat> very wild name uh, for me to say. Ma Ma Maldon Bruskovac, I think. Uh, I'm going to listen and try and see if I can figure out how to say it without uh, totally butchering it. You know, but people who know me know that I am dyslexic and whatnot. So, but if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. Check out getting to know Colonel Jack, which is my former name. I go by Crazy Joe, which is my real name now. But anyways, uh, you know, because my name is Joe, and people call me crazy. So anyways, Big Doug Jimmy's back there. He's going for Blackovitz. I'm going for Rico Van Hooven, and I believe Van Hooven's going to win by knockout. But uh, both these guys are, are wicked strong. It's going to be crazy. Ooh, uh, Maladon lighting up Van Hooven. <clears throat> Van Hooven lighting them back up. It's crazy. So this is live as it's going down. Breaking it down with my review reaction and results. Verhoeven is in the gray and blue. And the competitor, uh, contender is in the red and black for uh, Breslovak. I believe is how you say it. So I believe they said four knockdowns in a round results in a TKO victory. Breslovac, I think is how they're saying it. Ooh, kicking, they're both kicking legs and kicking high. Uh, it's lefts and rights and knee to the gut from Van Hooven. Van Hooven kneeing him in a clinch against the ropes. And they break it up. Back in the center of the ring. Van Hooven with some, ooh, a body kick. A body knee to the body. Uh, Melvedon is to just try to toss him over the top rope, but he stopped. Having some respect for each other. So it's just kind of full of the move of motion. Ooh, he faked a jump kick there. The big heavyweight's going for some kicks. Ooh, blasting to the left and rights. Verhoeven, I think, got the better of that one. And uh, this is just nuts. Uh, they said somebody trains with an AKA. Maybe it's Verhoeven? I'm not sure. I don't know. So... 30 seconds to go, less, well now 20 seconds to go in the first round, and uh, it's very tough to say, ooh, he, uh, the champion just ate a right going in to do his own right, he ate a right uh, straight left through the gloves of our Hooven by the competitor, Brockovich. Ooh, he just ate a right, a left, I mean. Ooh, on the bell, Verhoeven rocked the competitor. The contender, Maldon Brock or Brestowitz, Brestovas, Brestovas, I think is how they're saying it, Brachovas. So it's pretty crazy. So the first round, I'd have to say, goes to Rico Verhoeven on that one. I think he won the first round. I uh, would be surprised if the judges seen it otherwise, but the judges won't always see it the same way we see it or I see it. You know, so. This is going to be very interesting. To see what happens in this one. So, the, um, the it's been an awesome event, I'd have to say. This is, I'm definitely digging Glory Kickboxing. I'm really loving it. Uh, the last event was awesome. This uh, this is awesome too. I want to see the winner of this go against uh, Guto Innocent. You know, what I mean, he knocked that dude out and put him on a stretcher. It's crazy. So, Verhu Rico kicking away and blasting. Ooh, he Rico just ate a body. The trade left and rights. Ooh, they're both hitting each other left and rights, and they're up on the clinch. There was some vicious shots there, I'd have to say. What, Big Doug Jimmy? Ooh, he just ate a knee. What's up with that headlock, dude? You're not allowed to do that. Not in kickboxing, anyways. 
So Rico Verhoeven has landed 6 of 20 right now, and uh, Breskovac has only landed 1 in the second round, I think that is. I believe that's, that's or maybe that was the first round. There's, I don't know about them stats, like, there's punches that look like, ooh, that was a nasty kick. By Verhoeven to the leg of Brokovic, Bresovac, and Rico tying up, knee in each other in the legs. I think that uh, Rico is going to have the better stamina of the two of them, personally. he Did he just kiss his forehead? Did he just kiss him on the head? Did Bresovac just kiss Rico, or did I was I seeing shit? I don't know. Ooh, kicking away on each other. Oh, boy, he kicked his arm pretty hard there. Brakovac, Bres, Bresovac, I'm saying the name all over the place. <laughs> it's like I can hear myself say it wrong or twisted and different and contorted and whatnot. The referee breaks up a clinch, and, um, you know, Rico is going for knees to clinch, and again with knees, um, Maladin is, uh, Rico and Maladin are blasting away on each other in the clinch, and they're up against the ropes again and getting broken up. Come on, guys. I know it's tough. Ooh, a bla Maladin blasting away on Rico. He kicked him in the in the stomach, then he kicked him in the head, but it was blocked. And Rico has got him up in the corner. He's got him cornered. He gets out of the corner, and Rico is going for some kicks of his own. Ooh, blasting him. Come on. Ooh, like, ooh, Rico got blasted with an uppercut by Maladin. Maladin. Looks like he's going to get taking the upper hand in the second round with 30 seconds to go. That was a vicious uppercut. But Rico is coming back with the hunt on Maladin. He's hunting him down and he's got him in the corner. Oh, Maladin's coming out of the corner, blasting away. Rico hits him with a right and kick. They both kick each other at the same time. Maladin goes for a fake jump kick and he ends up blasting with some lefts and rights on Rico as we're about to ring the bell. A leg kick by Rico. Rico and Maladin pat gloves and we go into a third round. This is awesome. Right. You enjoying it, Big Doug Jimmy? Some awesome fight in action here. We love fights on Crazy Joe's Galaxy. Subscribe today now. A live reaction review as it's going down with the results, breaking it down, trying to tell you exactly what's going down as it's going down and happening here, you know. So this dude's yelling at the dude. He's a little dude, and he's yelling at this big giant heavyweight, and he's yelling at him. To, he's yelling at Maladin to knock him out. He's like, what are you doing to knock him out? He's, I don't know what he's saying. He's just yelling a bunch of stuff at him. And uh, Rico's just standing up. He's not even sitting down like Maladin. Team Rico. Team Rico Suave. I mean, Verhoeven. Remember Rico Suave? Check that out in the Google and watch that video, music video. If you don't know, now you know. Rico Suave Verhoeven. Verhoeven comes out with some kicks to begin. Oh, he blasts him with a right. Rico hit um, Aladdin with a nasty right, and he and Aladdin answers back with a head kick, but it blocked it blocked by Rico, by Rico, by Rico, Rico, and um, Aladdin is going with some lefts and rights onto Rico, and he's getting him. Uh, Rico is backing up, and then he does a front kick. Aladdin goes for a kick, front kick as well. Verhoeven has got uh, strikes landed by Rico with fifteen. And 18, I think, and then 4 and 15 for Breskovac, Maladin. And uh, this is so it looks like by the stats that Rico's winning both rounds. Uh, you know, that second round was hard to judge, but I would say, ooh, Rico with a body, with a knee to the body, and then a vicious right to Maladin. Looks like Maladin's getting a little rocked. I think Maladin is going is is dazed and confused right now. I got a feeling right now, right by, right after the two minute mark, he got a little dazed there, and uh, he we're at a minute forty and counting, and he's going with a he missed the uppercut, going for some body kicks. Ooh, we need him. Ooh. Rico just got blasted with some body with an uppercut. Boom. 
watts. Yeah, they're still not home yet. I was kind of surprised. I thought they'd be home by now. He's got two more rounds. So he's going. Oh, we need him. Need him. Clenching up. Hmm. Yeah. But it's it's only me and Big Dog Jimmy is a showing. So, but it's a heavyweight title fight with Glory Kickboxing right now. Rico Verhoeven versus Maladin Breskowak. That's crazy. Hmm. I, th I think they're eating over there. I was going to make him something soon. Rico. Looks like Rico's winning this round. He's got more stamina. He's using his jab, his kicks. And Maladin is using the size some. <laughs> They're both big, though. He's... Ooh! Rico just blasting Maladin with a nasty right jab that rocked him again. I think we're going to be seeing a KO here in the fourth round coming up. We're 10 seconds left to the third round. I think... Ooh! Did he just knee him in the junk? I'm not sure. That... that it was either in the fire or the junk, but the ref didn't see it and stop it. But the way that uh, Maladin Bresovac reacted was kind of like as if that was kind of low. Uh, maybe it was up in the gut. Uh, that was difficult to tell with that one. We are going to the championship rounds now with Rico Verhoeven versus Maladin Bresovac. Bresovac. Something. His last name's crazy. So... But like I said, I don't know any other languages but English. So I try my best to say the lames. The lames. Names. What, Big Doug, Jimmy? Yeah, I watch the way you're talking. You're going to be sleeping outside again. I let you sleep in the house. So Rico's already ready, and Maladin is still sitting down in the corner. His team is still in there as Rico and his team got out, and uh, now Maladin's team's all out. Fourth round out of five champ out of five rounds, we are in the fourth round with these heavyweights. Can you believe it? A lot of heavyweight fights end early. Both of these guys are tough as nails. Wicked heart, wicked determination. Rico wants to retain the belts. And stay the champion. Maladin wants to win it to become the champion. Ooh, Maladin with some kicks and body shots. And Rico answers back with a flurry and clinch. Ooh, a head kick by Maladin in an uppercut. And Rico answers back with some kicks of his own. We're getting a flurry from both of them. Maladin with a bunch of kicks and in goes. Rico with some overhand rights, a body kick by Rico. Rico is going, lighting them up with lefts and rights, and they clinch up. We got two minutes to go in the fourth round. And Rico with a flurry of his own. But, I mean, uh, Maladin with a flurry. Rico is getting ready to pile oh, up. Maladin with some straight rights, and Rico answering back with a little flurry and kicks. Mixing it up. Neither one of them there. Oh, he was going to go for some kind of kick, and he ended up eating a kick of his own. Maladin. Oh, almost. He blocked the head kick. Rico with an overhand right miss, kind of. Oh, a straight right hand. They clinch again up in the corner with a minute 20 to go. What's going to happen next? Ooh, uppercut by Maladin. It kind of clenched up. I'm kind of surprised the ref didn't break that up. Oh, he's breaking it up now. Ooh, ooh, Maladin just rocked the head of Rico. And uh, Rico kind of answering back at him, Maladin. Ooh, Rico just rocked Maladin with the right, and then they clinch. And now they're broken up. Oh, Maladin with the left and a right on Rico's skull. Oh, it's straight right by Maladin. Maladin with a flurry. With a one, two, three combination and a body kick. Oh, Rico with a kick. Rico is eating a bunch of straight rights. And he's trying to go in. 
and uh, goes for a body shot and misses, goes in the clinch. Seems that Rico's better when he's up closer, and Maladin is doing a lot better when the, the distance is there, is what it appears to be. We got 10 seconds to go in the fourth round. I was wrong about a knockout unless it happens right now in the fourth round. So we're going to the fifth and final championship round. I did not expect this at all. Big Dog Jimmy told me at the beginning he thought it was going to go five rounds, so that I just didn't, I, I, wasn't, I didn't think so when they were walking. I was like, I bet this is going to go five rounds. And I was like, nah, I think this is going to be a knockout in like the third or fourth round. But I, I still got Rico winning this three rounds to one. Uh, you know, that's how I got it scored. But you never know what the judges, how do they have it scored so far? Unless there's a KO here or TKO. It's, uh, you know, if you get, somebody get knocked down a bunch of times, TKO. You know, or a straight knockout to finish it instead of going to the judges. Uh, a lot of fights tonight, today, have been to the judges. Been pretty interesting. You know, so we'll see what the World Series of Fighting tonight, if that ends up happening with their championship fight of uh Gay of uh, Geisher versus Foster, you know, so that's gonna be interesting. Five, fifth and final round is underway. Enrico comes in with a flurry with left and right and a body kick and Maladin answering back with a front kick of his own. And another kick by Maladin. And a jab by Maladin. Ooh, a right by Maladin and a Leg kick by Rico. Rico with some rights of his own and a body kick and another hit and another one into the clinch. <laughs> Rico did not want to back up on the ref. He wanted to stay right there on the Maladin. Rico faking a kick. Ooh. Maladin going right through into the chest of Rico. Rico. Closing up the distance, going in. Ooh, body kick, leg kick. Rico going in with multiple shots on the Latin. Maladin answering back with a flurry of his own. Oosh. This I, I got a feeling we're going to go two more minutes and it's going to go to the judges. I don't think either one of these guys is going to get knocked out now. And then Rico is going to remain the champion. The way this is going doesn't look like... Uh, Either one of them's gonna, let you know, either one of them's got the power to knock out the other one because they're both wicked tough. I don't think either one of them's getting knocked out tonight. But maybe I'll end up eating my words here in a moment. <laughs> With a minute 30 to go. And they clinch up again. And then they go to the crowd or a corner man randomly. Ooh! A left by Maladin, and then Rico answers back with a flurry. That woke up Rico, it looked like. That was a nasty shot, I and mean, he answered back with a bunch of shots. And then uh, Maladin answering back. Ooh, a body kick by Rico. Rico with another body kick. The front body kick that time. We're going to see an uppercut, some uh, straight body shots. I think body shots right now would be a good idea. Ooh, a knee to the head of Maladin by Rico. That was nasty. I think that rocked him again. Rico is rocking Maladin. Yeah, with some leg kicks there. 30 seconds to go in this championship fight for the heavyweight championship and glory kickboxing. Are we going to see a KO here out of nowhere in 20 seconds? Probably not, but we'll get some awesome action as it is anyways. Ooh, Maladin with some shots, and Rico ended up answering back, and he gets an overhead kick to Maladin. Maladin blocked it slightly, but then he comes through with some jabs and a right. Ooh, they're just laying it all on the line here with the last 10 seconds, and then, oh, and Maladin gets the last shot, and they dap gloves, and they hug. What are the judges going to go with the decision? Well, I, uh, I, I, glad I didn't make it about Big Dog Jimmy about it going five rounds and going full five rounds. Uh, that last round's kind of hard to score, but I gotta say Rico four rounds to one over Maladin in my opinion. 
I'd have to say it's going to be 49-46. What will the judges decide? This is going to be an interesting fight. I mean, an interesting uh, decision. Will we see a new champion crown or not? So with the stats real quick of the, well, some highlights here um, that they're showing. Uh, nasty left by um, Maladin and then some kicks by Maladin. Third round, we got a head kick by Maladin. They're showing a lot of stuff by Maladin more than uh, Rico. Kind of surprised. I felt that Rico ended up doing more damage. Ooh. <laughs> Interesting. They like barely I like that. That was weird. So who is going to be the champion? Are we gonna have a new champion or not? They're standing behind Maladin, so I kinda of think Maladin's gonna get the belt. I don't think Maladin won that fight. Let's find out. What are the judges gonna say? 49-46, 50-45. Fifty forty five, unanimous decision. All and still champion Rico Bahuva and I told you, big dog Jimmy, that he was gonna win and remain the champion. That was an awesome, uh, that was an awesome fight. A lot of technical skill there on that, and they're getting ready to put the belt on him. So that was awesome. Rico Bahuva remains the champion. Can anybody stop Rico? So, um, we're going to go over some stats here in just a moment. So, let's see. Where are they? So, Rico landed 101 punches total. 100, he landed, Rico landed 101 total strikes of 327 attempts with 31%. And Malden landed 51 total strikes of 178 attempts for 29%. So, definitely Verhoeven landed way more. He won the fight, like I said. And, my, you know, and that was awesome. A lot of fun. Really enjoyed that fight. Really cool. Glory kickboxing. Doing more justice. Looking forward. Who will challenge Rico Verhoeven next? I personally want to see... Uh, you know, Guto Innocent get that shot. I think that would be a fantastic fight. Will it happen soon or will it be later? Leave me a comment down below. Like the video. Subscribe. Thanks for watching. Crazy Joe and Big Doug Jimmy out.